In this video, we will look at how fast and easy it is to install a video wall from start to finish with Userful. We will also cover some of the key things to consider when deploying a video wall in order to save time and money. First, watch how easy Userful makes video wall installation. Now that you've seen how easy it is to install a video wall with Userful, let's go back and take a look at some of the key steps involved. Step 1. Layout and Sizing Understanding your audience and ensuring stakeholders agree on your video wall's purpose and the type of message you want to deliver is important. This will affect all aspects of the video wall, including design, layout and sizing. Is your goal clear communication of specific written messages, grid layout, or is it to make an impact with a unique design, artistic layout? Step two, location and placement. A prominent location is important. Consider your surroundings and lighting conditions to ensure visibility and legibility throughout the day. Be aware that sun or bright lights can darken the display and create glare. Step 3. Mounting. There are a wide range of video wall mounts. You need to ensure your wall and mounting system can handle the weight and size of the displays. Zero client devices can be mounted to the back of your displays using Visa mounts. The zero client devices can be set to always power on automatically via either a dip switch or rocker switch. Verify the structural integrity of the wall before mounting and follow all display mounting guidelines in the display and mount products you purchase. If you're mounting more than a few rows of displays directly on the wall, ensure there is sufficient space for the heated air from the displays to rise. If you are recessing the displays to be plush with the surface of the wall, Ensure there is ventilation or active cooling so the displays don't overheat. Be sure any freestanding display support structures are sufficient to support the weight of your displays. Step 4. Wiring and Connectivity The host PC can be either at the video wall location or in the server room. You can also place the Ethernet switch in the server room if desired. In this case, as we are using the existing network infrastructure, all the cabling runs to an outlet in the wall. When configuring the video wall, you can use a wireless network connection to remotely access the userful PC, making it easy to set up and manage your video wall from a laptop or tablet. Remember that you need a gigabit switch for video walls up to 25 screens and a switch with a 10 gig uplink for larger video walls. Any electrical work required should be done by a qualified professional. Step 5. Content. You can display just about any content on a userful video wall. You can use standard video formats, MP4, AVI, MPEG, etc., organized in a playlist. You can use one or more HDMI or SDI capture cards and display multiple HDMI sources such as cameras, laptops, media players, and more. Network streaming is another way to deliver content to your video wall. Also, there are content management systems that allow you to schedule content in a personalized canvas. Userful also supports browser delivered content and full screen desktops for just about any OS for control room and command center applications. If you need help with your video wall installation, give us a call at 403-289-2177 or email us at getstarted at userful.com. We're happy to help anytime. 
You can also visit our website, userful.com. We have a lot of great resources on our website, including pricing and a free buyer's toolkit in which we have compiled our best tips to help save time and money on any video wall installation. Powered by Userful.